After a record-breaking precipitation in the past two years, it's hard to believe the drought monitor would be watched in Kelloland. But as meteorologist Brian Carstens explains, dry pockets are beginning to pop up. Thunderstorm areas have kept parts of Kelloland at or above normal for precipitation this year so far. But there are exceptions and we'll continue to watch the drier pattern emerging. June is typically one of the wettest times of the year. That's true for some areas again. The 30 day rainfall paints a few pockets of blue west of Sioux Falls, where thunderstorms earlier this week left a footprint of heavy rain. However, spots that miss the rain are gaining attention. For far northeastern South Dakota and west central Minnesota, that's a developing story. In fact, the drought monitor shows moderate drought in that area. The drought monitor wasn't even a thought last year. Here's what the map looked like one year ago. Very little drought was found in the United States. But this year, we've had a big shift toward a drought in Colorado, New Mexico, and western Kansas. It's unlikely this drought will improve as we approach the hottest time of the year. This area of drought is part of the reason we're featuring a hotter seven day forecast. We'll continue to watch these things as we head into next week. For Kevin Land Weather, I'm meteorologist Brian Karstens.